the CyberKnife is a newer technology that allows us to treat prostate cancer non-invasively. What we do is we get very sophisticated imaging of the patient's prostate. We get an MRI and a CAT scan and we fuse those images into one image. And then the radiation oncologist and the surgeon, we sit down together and we actually go through all of these images one by one. And we outline the very specific structures of the prostate and the surrounding structures. So we can then give instructions to the computer to say we want this dose to just treat the prostate, to kill the prostate cancer, but we want to make sure that the rectum and the bladder and the nerves that control erections are protected and don't receive a high dose. And that's what we spend a lot of time doing behind the scenes, before the patients are treated. Now, the, when the patients are laying on the table, there is a robotic arm that actually moves around the patients, almost 360 degrees around the patient. And one dose, one beam of radiation is given from hundreds of different locations. So each one of those beams is a very low dose, so it causes very little side effects or damage to the tissue that it's moving through. But when those beams come together from hundreds of different locations and hit the focal point or the prostate, they destroy the cancer. When we initially started treating patients with a cyber knife, we were treating patients uh, in five consecutive days, Monday through Friday. There is some uh, initial data out uh, on the cyber knife that has actually showed that if we can treat patients in five days every other day, so Monday, Wednesday, Friday, the following Monday, and then Wednesday, that there may be actually a little bit less side effects. Uh, we've had great success. Our, the patients uh, we're following, we make sure we monitor their PSA, and we've seen a very nice drop off in the PSA over the years since we've treated them, which we expect to see to show that the cancer is being cured. Uh, we've been monitoring patient side effects in terms of what are their urinary side effects and what are their problems they may be having with erectile dysfunction. And we've found actually very minimal side effects with the majority of our patients, which is very exciting. And that's what we had hoped with this technology is that we can still maintain the absolute best cure while minimizing the side effects as best we can. So actually, if you look at the overall costs of the CyberKnife treatments, it's actually a little bit less than some of the other treatments because it is a shorter period of time of treatment. So the cost effectiveness is actually quite good, and that's something we're looking at as well because we want to not only make sure that we are offering best cure, minimal side effects, but also a cost-effective treatment. And a CyberKnife treatment is covered by most insurance companies, and uh, so it's really generally not a problem. We do pre-screen patients to make sure that this won't be a problem for them. Uh, before we offer to them. So anytime you're seeing a physician about treating your prostate, there's a number of questions you want to ask. Number one is, what's their experience? How, much of, how many patients have they treated in the past? And how long have they been doing this for? And what's their approach? And how are they going to be followed? Um, these are certainly things that you want to know about. What can you expect? What side effects can you expect? When and how are they going to be managed? and you want to make sure that you have a working relationship with your physician because the truth is we're going to work with you to cure your cancer but you need to have a relationship with your physician to, so that they're your advocate and I believe that that's certainly very important.